Because I could see a steely sitting in this. Oh, fish, 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 steelhead. Four bucks. You too. Just got here, waiting for Kyle to pull up. Just waiting for him to get off the exit, but I'm looking for a campsite right now before he pulls up because we don't really know where we're going to be staying tonight. So, All right, this might be a little confusing. I haven't made an update here in a minute, but I think Kyle and I are going to be sleeping at Walmart tonight. So Kyle and I drove around for about two and a half hours trying to find a primitive campsite. We came up, well, really, this is Kyle's idea. <laughs> And camping in a Walmart parking lot. Welcome to Camp Chrome. Stop, you're, you're tweaking more than I am. You guys chill out. There's gotta have been crazier things that gone down at a Walmart parking lot in retrospect here. All right, bro, you wanna throw that inside then we'll get the wood stove? Yeah. There's quite literally a Walmart employee right there with a shopping cart. Is that just paper lit or is it? Yeah, we might have to go in and get a couple fire starters. Oh yeah, she's coming out all right. Have people talking about us? Oh no, I'm not sure about that, but see some definite smoke coming out of here. <laughs> Job, Kyle, on the fire. Well, we got a hot fire going. We haven't been kicked out yet, so that's good. There are three security cameras just chilling right there. I, I don't even know how I didn't notice that earlier, dude. Gosh. You you know 100% that all the employees, all the employees are just huddled around watching the security cameras right now. All right, guys. I think we're gonna get some shut eye. I still can't believe that uh, we got this set up. Hopefully we make it throughout the night. I feel like we are at this point, but this is the start of a crazy trip. It's not a couple inches. Not bad, not bad. All right, we are crossing into the Canadian border right now. About a minute. Oh, we are in Canada. Talked to a couple locals, they've all been friendly. Getting some pretty solid report, but man, it sounds like this place is pretty sketchy with the flows, super clear water, and so we're getting studded up and making sure that we're you know taking every means possible to stay as safe as we can on this water. But whoa! It goes from here and drops. Can you walk on this? Yeah, we crossed this. What? Dude, this is nuts. Yeah. This is for the little boats that go from here. This is like 20 feet, 30 feet. This one that much, they have bigger ones on the other side. Bigger ones? Huge ones, man. Like iron ore ships go through these. Wow, this is sweet. Wow. Looks like the gauge might be down. We might be able to fish a lot of the big size. Wow, this is awesome, guys. You just got rapids going into the abyss. Yeah, you can fish both sides. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I like this. And do you think I could wade out to that rock and cast up? What's that? All the rocks not, you get slick. I know, like, yeah, I feel like I could walk across right here. The snot doesn't look bad right here. <laughs> yeah, she's slick still. I don't know. Almost got that. Racked my shin pretty good there. Alright, let's see if we get up on this damn thing. 
<laughs> Jump! Hey! I'm almost more scared to come down. <laughs> What? I got you on video falling. I, oh, we were recording? Oh, yeah. Oh, great. Dude. Like, well, we're falling. We're going to have it on video. Just wait till you see this hole. Walk towards that rock and then up. There's going to be a little current right there and then it gets dead. Oh, I thought for a minute there. Cause like I can. Really? Cause I could see a steely sitting in this. Oh, fish, 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 steelhead. Oh yeah, dude. Oh wait, is that an Atlantic? No way. This might be an Atlantic. I'm not even kidding. Oh my goodness. Maybe it's a steelhead. It's it's yeah, it's got that narrow head on it. All right, I think I'm gonna drag it this way. I think it's a steely. No. Yep. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Okay. I've seen derps, but I haven't seen. Wow. Maybe. Nice fish, dude. Heck yeah. Here, don't, I might. I might trade you here. Risk that for the biscuit out here, man. Casey was recording me coming out here. You guys probably saw me slipping around, but my God, man, it's been a tough day. Made the long haul out here onto this rock. I have never caught a steelhead with a dirt face like that. That might be something, you know when it was a baby coming up in the rapids hitting its head on the rocks or something i'm not sure but took a nice chartreuse spawn bag right there nice fresh fish casey if you want to pull the bag out man do the honor but i'm stoked first ever fish here in the ripping fast water and it's a nice fresh one man cannot complain here do you want to maybe hold my rod and get one more shot of it it's got the adipose man i don't know what their clipping's like over here but i mean Nice clean fish. Nice perky dorsal fin. When siren sounds, please beware of rising water level. I'm so excited because nobody's here. In the second, I mean the literal second I pull into here, a siren goes off and telling me to beware of rising water level. I get here and they're opening the floodgates. <laughs> It's a daunting sound, guys. I'm not gonna lie. So I make it to this concrete slab here, guys. Once I make it there, we'll be good. Oh yeah, this water's higher. It was at least a foot lower. Was looking around inside the marshes here and we just came across this thing i saw it just flailing around Def i definitely think that this could pull one that might be my ticket right there that might that might save the skunk for the day we'll see of course my gopro dies all day fish all day and then the one drift literally i was at three percent i checked the drift it died and I hooked a fish. This, thing, this might be in Atlanta. Is it? It's actually a pretty clean one. That is. That is so funny. I was literally just talking to Adam here. See this grub or something chilling right on the bank, squirming around, and then I hook an Atlantic within five minutes after having no bites all day. Oh yeah, it's showing up. Cool guys, check this out. Canadian Atlantics. 
International Bridge right behind me. Guys, we're gonna let her go right now. Sweet. <laughs> Shut the scum, baby. Let's nice go. <laughs> Thanks, man. That's gonna do it for me in this trip. Two solid days of fishing. Two solid fish, I can't complain. That was my first ever Lake Huron steelhead. First ever Canadian steelhead, for that matter. And uh, my first ever River Atlantic. That was pretty cool. Man, I tell you what, if I didn't find that freaking thing crawling out of the ground, I don't know if I would've caught a fish today. So, nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, definitely think we'll be back.